most government ministries are on their staff. We're looking at 220 individuals. 120 would be the uniform officers at the borders and at our various offices. The Department of uh, Nationality and Passports has no more than 50 individuals. So we're working with public service to increase that. In the simplest sense, that department has one person in each out district office. By October, we need minimum of three people to simply manage the passport system. So again, the, the ministry was separated, specifically the immigration part and border management and nationality service, border management and immigration services receive a large number of the employees. Why? Because the passport system wasn't working. Why put three people out district when the system isn't working and individuals will be coming to Belmopan anyway? So that was apart from the structural issues, the assistant director not being there, the legal officer not being there. I've read documents where they recommended four assistant directors for border management and immigration services while we only have one. So we've been working with public service, Ministry of Finance in terms of beefing up these numbers. Uh, in November, the cabinet approved for six individuals to be hired to work at the Philip Golson International Airport. Why? Large number of tourists coming in. So we could literally say that for each department. So the fact is, like many other government ministries, we don't have enough human resources. And that's where I come in. I have to motivate the administrative officers and get everyone on the same track to bring this together.